Hey guys, it's your girl Tina. I wanna go ahead and shout out Jamie Garcia Reyes. She's one of the first ones to send me this story, but I have been tagging this story all over Instagram. This entire situation is just really damn ridiculous. And once again, it's coming from our first favorite state, wretched ass Florida, okay? So what's going on now in Florida, you ask? What's going on is that we have a mother from Tampa and she decided to throw her son who was turning eight years old. She decided to throw him a birthday party. And for his birthday, what did she get him? Not an Xbox One, not a PlayStation 4, not no Jordans. She decided to get him a big booty stripper. Big booty stripper for my eight year old son, for my eight year old son. When I tell you some of these damn parents when i tell you some of these damn parents need to have several damn seats go ahead and check out this video clip that's going viral all over social media and i'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary All right, so you guys just saw that video. So a lot of folks want to know my opinion on this situation. And my opinion is, I feel like the mother and the stripper both need to be brought up on charges, okay? It is never okay to sexualize a child, especially a child that young. You got him sitting there in a chair, having this grown woman shake her fat ass in his face. He's smacking her ass. I mean, the whole situation is really damn ridiculous. And you have a bunch of kids sitting around laughing and thinking that this behavior is normal. And then the crazy thing would be when this little boy goes to school, and he starts sexualizing other little girls and thinking that it's okay to slap women on their asses and ask little girls to twerk for him. Then the mother will be playing crazy and acting like she doesn't know where her son got that from. A child this young should not be exposed to anything sexual that early because they're gonna start acting out in that manner, thinking that it's okay and thinking that it's acceptable. You know, the stripper is just as trifling as well. Now I understand times are hard, honey, and I understand, you know, being on your grind, but if somebody's calling you and saying, you know, can you come and strip for my eight? Year old, I think you should be mature enough to say, you know what? All money is not good money. I only strip for people 18 and over, okay? I mean, for the stripper to be sitting there shaking her ass like it's okay, it makes no sense. It's like, what the hell are these two thinking? Now, another thing that bothered me with this video is one thing I noticed is even though there's kids in the room and they're giggling and laughing and watching this, I don't see not one balloon. I don't see no decorations. I don't see anything to show that it's a birthday party. So let me get this right. So the mother can't decorate the living room to make it look like a birthday party, but yet and still she can drop some cash to hire a stripper to have him come strip for her eight year old son. When I tell you some folks just do not have their priorities together what's so damn ever. So anyways, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire ratchet ass story, honey. That's once again coming from our first favorite state, ratchet ass Florida. All right, deuces. Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.